Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with a review. Y'all, it's so hot outside, y'all, and my air is not working in my car. And I made an appointment to get it serviced to see what was wrong with it. And I made an appointment in May. My appointment is not until the end of July. So I said, okay. I know my dad told me he tried to put some Freon in or whatever like that. He told me your compressor wasn't moving and working like that. So I'm like, God, it's so dang gonna hot, y'all. It'd be 101 up to 105 degrees here in Georgia, y'all. It haven't been this hot in a minute. And it's summertime and I need some air. So what I did, I went on Amazon and they had great reviews on this. car fan great reviews on it and it's by Hugh Live and this is a 12 volt you can use it for small cars medium cars or even in your truck or van you all yes all three um it's energy saving and environmental protection um moisture proof and all of that um yeah, this is a vehicle fan and I said I want to try it out, so y'all, it came with a um, a pamphlet also, and it just tells you to, um, now some of them have a suction, they have different kinds, but I got the flat kind, which looks like this. This is the flat kind, okay? You can sit on your dashboard, and it came with two adhesive, um, like this, you peel them off and stick them up under here and mount, and mount it to your dashboard. And my dashboard is not flat, but we're going to see if we can make it work, okay? i seen where um, on one review, somebody had it on their window like this. Towards that, they just put in a window and the fans are um, facing them. Now, they also have single ones that you can put on the back of your headrest for the back of the car, but I'm using mine for the front now. If I want to invest in the ones, that, the swivel ones that go on, not swivel ones, but the um, single ones that go on the back of your headrest, I may do that. But guess what, you all? It can go up and down, and that's a good thing. And you can move it around like that to different sides, the patch side or your driver's side, so... I'm going to give this a try. Okay. Great reviews. Yes. It was only $26 on Amazon. And this is your um, on and off button. The light will come on. And what you do is stick it in your cigarette lighter. Cigarette um, yeah, lighter. Okay. You turn your car on. Let it already be in there. Turn your car on. Turn your fan on have your adjustment like I said it swivels it turns left or right or however you want it to go yes yeah, so we gonna see and y'all they said it's not noisy yes yeah, so we gonna see about that okay <laughs> they said it's not noisy let me see what else it said on this box um all around adjustment so I already showed you how you can adjust it and it's no noise so um only thing about that, if you need to charge your phone or whatever like that, you're going to have to take it out and charge your phone with a cigarette lighter. So, I already have my phone charged. <laughs> okay? So, I'm going to try this out, you all. I wish my dashboard was flat like this, but we're going to see. I'm going to take y'all outside in my car. But the instruction the book here, it just says um, the suction cup of absor absorption on the glass or smooth plain. I'm going to put mine on smooth plain, okay? And if you want to clean it, make sure that it's turned completely off. You don't want to break your little um, vent fans that are in there. Um, um, they said start the car up and plug it in the cigarette lighter, okay? And to connect the fan and suction cup, adjust an appropriate angle of fan, tighten the swivel nut, turn on the switch. So I showed you all that. But this is the little dialogue that they do have here. Just showing you what it can do. 
But like I said, I just have the one that's flat. So I'm putting my flat pane, which is my dashboard, okay? And it also shows me a picture on how you can go about doing that. And that's pretty much it. And the rest of the book is in no language, so yeah, that's it. So we're going to go out here in this heat. <laughs> it's 7 o'clock right now, but it's still warm, but it's not as hot as it was earlier today. And yes, um, I just want to give you all this review on this vehicle fan. Yes, and I hope it's going to give me some justice. <laughs> yes, because it's hot, like I said. So let's get into it. Okay, y'all, I'm in my car. I have mounted the adhesive on the bottom. You probably can see it up on there. But as you can see, it's kind of slanted because my dashboard is not level like that, okay? So I put it right here slanted, like right up under the radio. I have a Buick Century. So, yeah. <laughs> And like you, I said, you can swivel it around like that or up or whatever. If your um, passenger don't want it on there, they can put it up or whatever. Okay? But I don't have people in my car. So it's going to be on me. It's in the cigarette lighter down here. Okay? Now we're going to cut this on. Like they said, it's noiseless. Cut it off. And it has levels too. It can go down. Off. And it can go up. doing what it said it needs to do and as you can see it's cycling it's cycling around okay you live you live you live however you pronounce it and I'm gonna ride around not too far I'm just gonna ride and see how it cools the, the car off while it's on and yeah it's cooling off already it feels so good you all it feels good it feels good it feels good when i first get in my car because it's going to be hot i roll my windows down to get some of that heat out so yes and especially in the morning it's going to be real cool i know that so yeah this is my tutorial on my new life um vehicle fan and if you don't have air in your car, I advise you to get one. And like I said, they have several kinds. You can put two on the back of your headrest if you want. And I may do that for the back passengers. Like I said, I don't have people to ride in with me. <laughs> yes. But, um, yeah. You all go ahead and um, get you all one. And I will put the um, description below from Amazon, how much it was, and the link, and all of that. I thank you all for tuning in to Explicit Wellness. And you all have a great day, a great night, or whatever. But um, I thank you all. Make sure you subscribe, share, and like my video, and comment down. And I'll be gladly to get back with you. Thanks.